We'd like to welcome Carlotta Sagana back to the interview room today. Uh, Thank you. One under par 70, but you said you actually really played well today. Just talk about your round. Yeah, I started playing really good my first five holes, hitting really close to the pin. And I didn't make those putts for birdie, but I, I birdied number four, the par three. So I was one under after six, and then I made two bogeys on the eighth and nine. I didn't hit the, the green, and I couldn't make the putts. But then I'm, I played really solid the back nine. Uh, shooting two under, and I think that's good because the conditions were not easy. The wind is picking up, and it was raining a little bit, so I'm happy with my round. That was my next question, the conditions. You're the first player we're, we've talked to today. Just how different was it today versus Thursday? Yesterday it was windy too. Today the only thing is it was more, more cold, and it was playing a little bit longer maybe. But I mean, it's a it's a course which which it can be really windy, and it's not easy to to putt well because it's uncomfortable. There are big greens out there, so just try to hit it the closest as possible, and then try to make some putts. Just um, if you would, just take us through how you got involved in the game of golf. Yeah, I started when I was five years old, so very young, and I live very close from from my golf course, which is a small town called La Reinsar which is 20 minutes from Pamplona. And I started with my dad and his friends. They used to play golf every day, and I used to go with my dad all the time. So I still play with them, and they play really good golf, and I really enjoy playing my time playing with them. So it's, it's great, and thanks to them, I'm, I'm, I'm here. And just tell us, you, you mentioned to me on the walk up, your caddy is a very good friend of yours. How, how does how's that relationship work? Yeah, he's, a, he's not a caddy. He's a really good friend of mine. He's helping me a lot. He started last year with me in Turkey. So we, we have been for one year. And last year it was great, but I mean, this year it's also been really good. He's really close, always happy to help. And he's a, a big f help for me because we travel together and it's really nice to have a friend always with you. So I'm very thankful to, to have him because he has a lot of patience and you mentioned for the last eight weeks you've been here in the States. Um, obviously a little bit different than playing the European Tour. What's, what's your favorite thing about being over here and maybe uh, any interesting experiences you've had since you've been traveling here in the United States? Yeah, I've been here for the last seven weeks and I really like the U.S. It's, it's a great country. I studied here and I mean I love it here because everything is easy. I mean... The courses we play, they are great, and then the people are very, very nice. I just stayed my weeks off in, in Arizona, which it was really nice to go back there and see my friends. And Europe, it's nice too, because I'm, I'm closer from home and I can, I can go home in the weeks off. But I love it here, and I think the, the future is to be here. So I'll be playing in the US and Europe this year, and then next year I'll, I'll try to come more here. Did I hear that you're now working with Sergio Garcia's manager? Is that? Yeah. Do yeah. you know Sergio at all? Have you played any golf with him? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we are good friends. And yeah, especially my dad is really good friends with his dad. So he came to, uh, to two tournaments last year, Sergio's dad, with me. And I mean, yeah, we have a really good relationship. And yeah, I love Sergio, his, his talent, the way he plays. And yeah, I'm working with his manager, so I'm very happy to, to work with them.